Problem number 11. Given the following information about the graph of a polynomial, f of x, which one of the following graphs is possible for y equals f of x? So we just have to pick the correct choice. So in this problem, the easiest way to do it is to first take the multiplicities and add them up. So the degree is equal to the sum of the multiplicities. So all you do is you add these up. So 3 plus 2 plus 1. So you end up with 6. So we have an even degree polynomial. That's key. And then you have to look at the leading coefficient. So leading coefficient. So the leading coefficient uh, is given. They tell us it's greater than 0. So greater than 0 means it's positive. Okay, so we have an even degree and a positive leading coefficient. Again, we know it's positive because that's what greater than 0 means. So whenever you have an even degree and a positive leading coefficient, just think, what's the simplest function you know that has these characteristics? Well, y equals x squared. Right? y equals x squared has an even degree and the leading coefficient is 1, so it's positive. So it kind of looks like this, it's a u. So it rises left and rises right. Rises left and rises right. This is called the leading coefficient test. So you look at the degree and uh, you look at the leading coefficient, then you think about the simplest function you know, and it looks like this. So now you just have to pick the choice that kind of looks like this. That would be choice A. So choice A is the correct answer. You can also go further and investigate the multiplicity of the x-intercepts, of the zeros. If it's odd, it should cross at that number. So here, 3 is odd, and you can see the graph crosses at negative 3. 2 is even, so it touches and turns around at 1. And 1 is odd, so it crosses at 3. But it's better uh, in these problems to just use this test here. So you look at the degree, and it's even. You look at the leading coefficient, so it's positive. Think about the simplest function you know. Draw the picture. It rises left, rises right. So the only one that rises left and rises right is choice A. So A is the answer to this question. So I hope that made sense.